Hi guys, it's day 146 of the national lockdown here in South Africa and we are on level 2. I like saying level 2. Um, the ban for alcohol and the selling of cigarettes have been lifted since yesterday and there's been reports saying that not a lot of people have been buying alcohol. The thing is, today's date is the 19th of August. Not a lot of people actually have money to go buy alcohol because they either are jobless or they don't actually have money to buy alcohol. So I can tell you now that next week when the payday comes, it is going to be a whole free for all. Um, one thing that I have noticed so far is the amount of stress that this lockdown has caused. Obviously for someone who has been retrenched, looking for a job to go, not go to, Sorry, I've been drinking a lot of wine. Life has just been a little bit tough today. Um, shit. <laughs> I'm just doing this for the for the video. Um, <laughs> that doesn't make sense either. Okay, I've really just finished a bottle of wine. Um, I probably need to go buy more alcohol because I'm going to be running out soon. Um, <laughs> shit <laughs> right <laughs> um yeah the one thing that i can say for sure about this um pandemic as well as the national lockdown is that it has affected everyone differently it's affecting everyone mentally emotionally um i can see that with myself i can see that with my mom um with this lockdown, there's a lot of repercussions and a lot of ripple effects that's affecting everybody. Um, today, my brother has just been notified that he's been um, evicted from his house, which is next door to us, um, which is quite a concern. And um, I did some research and during the lockdown period, they are not allowed to evict you. So hopefully he can take the information that I have sent him to his landlord and say, listen here, until the national lockdown is lifted, I am not moving, bitch. Right, this is day 146 and I'll see you tomorrow.